Hey everyone, welcome to Coffee and Crafting. My name is Lori. If you like home projects, thrift makeovers, and easy to make home decor all on a budget, then I hope you will consider to subscribe to my channel and join my DIY family. Today I have five table centerpieces using Dollar Tree and thrift items. They are easy to make, budget friendly, and they all have a beautiful high-end look that will be perfect for your Christmas decor. So grab a coffee or your favorite drink and let's start. I found a beautiful hurricane vase at my local thrift store for $6.99. This was a great find. I have some fairy lights on hand, but you can buy them at the Dollar Tree or any dollar store. And I'll place the fairy lights at the bottom of the vase. I have a bag of scented pine cones from Hobby Lobby. I'll put three pine cones at the bottom of the vase with the fairy lights and add the rest of the bag on top to fill the vase. You can add a bow or other embellishments or place the fairy lights throughout the pine cones and that will still look just as elegant. I love adding these type of uh, vases in my home during the holidays and winter. These make beautiful, elegant, cozy decor pieces that are perfect on top of a fireplace mantle as a table centerpiece Anywhere you can relax and enjoy the rustic outdoor vibe. found a hang up mirror at my local thrift store for $2.99. I'm going to use it as a tray instead of putting it on my wall. I have a package of glitter vase filler from the Dollar Tree. I'll add some on top of the glass. I have a glitter silver bottle brush tree from the Dollar Tree. I'll add fairy lights around the tree and place it on top of the mirror. I found this reindeer ornament with fur at Walmart. He's so cute and I really love this one. I'll place the reindeer on the mirror beside the tree and add a few more glitter balls. I decided to add a wood snowflake to the tray in my pictures. Let me know in the comments if you like the added snowflake or no snowflake. Love to hear from you. I love the vibrant glamour meets outdoor warm colors. The combination together complements each other perfectly. This is a great decor piece for Christmas and winter. I have a wicker tray on hand that I bought a long time ago. I'll take a piece of burlap and place it inside the tray. 
I have a wood snowflake from my dollar store and another wood reindeer from Walmart. I'll place both on the tray. I found the package of boho bottle brush Christmas trees from Walmart. I'll place three of them in the tray. I have a beautiful pine cone pick from Hobby Lobby. I'll bend the stem and lay it in the center of the tray. I'm going to add some pine cones in the tray. I love adding these to my decor pieces. I just think that they're a great addition. I'm going to add another Christmas tree from Walmart. And this one is a little bigger than the other ones. And to finish this tray, I'll add two cinnamon sticks for a really nice scent. I love the boho rustic look of this tray. It has a really beautiful natural look. And this will be perfect for after Christmas as a winter tray for any table. I have a really old wooden box that is going to be perfect for my Christmas rustic theme. I'm going to place a plastic container. This one is from the Dollar Tree. I'm going to use it as a riser because it's the only thing I could find that would fit inside. I'm going to cut two pieces of burlap. Hey everyone, thank you so much for joining me today. If you are new to my channel, Welcome, my name is Lori, and if you are returning, thank you so much for coming back. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please take a moment and consider to click that subscribe button and notification bell so you're notified when I upload any new videos. And if you can give me a thumbs up by clicking the like button, this really helps my channel to grow and be recognized and leave me a comment down below on which DIY you like the most or just say hello. I'll take the pieces of burlap and I'll crisscross them in the box and push them down onto the riser. This time of year is a time to I have a Christmas tree from the Dollar Tree. I'll assemble the tree and push the branches out. Have a Christmas with so much love and with joy and laughter. Let us make, Let us make memories that stay forever. I'll add some wire garland ties from the Dollar Tree in the center of the tree to make it fuller. All snow is falling down, all the colored lights lighting up this town. And as I walk outside, hear the Christmas. 
Christmas choir sing Merry Christmas to you. I'll place the tree inside the box on top of the riser and I'll push the bird lap inside the box around the bottom of the tree. I have a package of LED lights from the Dollar Tree. I'll add them to the Christmas tree. I have two strings of wood beads from the Dollar Tree. I'm going to string them around the tree and add some small embellishments of leaf picks and pine cones. I'm going to add bigger pine cones inside the box under the tree and I'll add a star on top. I'll finish the Christmas tree box with a metal reindeer pick from Michael's and just a few more pine cones. I really love how this Christmas tree turned out inside this old box. It has a beautiful rustic farmhouse look that is going to be a perfect addition to my Christmas rustic theme this year. a really nice thick piece of wood slab. I like decorating these and placing them around my house during the holidays. I have a cute little red truck ornament from Walmart. I'll remove the hanger and place it on top of the wood slab. I'll add two bottle brush trees from Hobby Lobby. These are so cute. They're wrapped up with burlap at the bottom and I just, I just think they're adorable. I'll add another big tree from Walmart. I love adding pine cones to my Christmas decor. It just, it gives it a really nice touch. I'll be adding lots of pine cones on the wood slab. I'm going to add a candle on the wood slab and I'll finish this beautiful display with some more embellishments. I love how this wood slab turned out with the natural wood colors that gives this piece its rustic farmhouse look. 
You can create so many different displays with the wood slabs and I will be creating a few more for Christmas. Elegance and beauty doesn't have to cost a lot to create something simple and easy that you can admire. I hope you have been inspired today with some new ideas for your Christmas decor this year. I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for joining me today and I hope I'll see you in my next video. So until then, have a beautiful day and bye for now.